What the quick wall? Earth robot line time and a robot I will be drawing today is Blanco. Woo! Woo! Blanco. He's from the Discovery Show called Butterbot. I highly recommend it. It's really awesome. I googled a picture of the 2019 version of Blanco and I have it on my phone in front of me. And I'm gonna be using that as a reference. Because he's so complicated. I need a reference for that dude. Okay, so let's begin. The first thing I like to begin with is the flipper. So it goes like, I think the flipper goes about like this. And I'm just using a pencil. Just America's pencil. Whoa. America. Okay, I'm just using a simple pencil. And I'm drawing pretty softly because I don't want to have trouble erasing it because this is just the first sketch. Kind of trying to get in here and I'm going to say, mm. Draw a flipper here. So, this is the first episode of this new channel. I'm pretty excited about it because I wanted to make a drawing channel for a while. Oh, I'm gonna change, I'm gonna move the world here. Woo! I like to rotate the paper because it's really helpful when you draw and stuff. Yeah, I'm just gonna try to get like a basic shape of the dude here. About like that. And it goes like this. I'm gonna rotate, rotate, whoa. And it's like this, it's a pretty radical line here. Like this, I think it's something like that. I'm drawing his flipper and then his thighs. I think it goes about like down like this and then he has this kind of wedge-like thing that goes down. It's pretty cool, pretty awesome. Yeah, so I like to turn it because it really helps to get it right. Get the like perspective right and make it look like 3D. You know, with drawing, you always want to make things look kind of 3D. So, turning it is really helpful to do that. So, right now, I'm just trying to get like a, um, a kind of rough sketch of everything uh, down. I'm probably going to change it a lot later, but I just kind of want to get like a rough sketch down. Yep. It's always a little intimidating to start a drawing with just, you know, just a plain piece of paper because you're like, oh, where am I going to put everything? And I think I'm kind of going off a little bit. But, you know, it's most important just to get the rough sketch down and then you can fix it all up. So it's okay. We got a wheel here. Wheels. And let me tell you guys, the wheels are hard to draw. Yeah, so this new channel is pretty exciting. I'm going to... I'm going to be drawing battle bots on it because they're so intricate and really awesome. I mean, Bronco, he's just so cool. I made actually a lot of a lot of videos about Bronco on my other channel, Captain the Queen Jack, because I got his little hex bug little toy, and it's been really fun to play with it. So I made a lot of videos if you want to check those out. I'll put them up in the i button. Yep, so I think I got to change this on, but I'm kind of going off my flipper. Yeah, so I'm just trying to get the basic sketch down. Let's see how I'm doing here. Mm, yep, I think it's flipper has to go like this. It goes out a little bit more than his wedge here. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, I'm not pressing very hard on the pencil, and I kind of got it cocked a little bit. I'm not going straight down. Got a little like that so I can make a pretty soft line. Of course, Bronco is a lot of straight lines, which are a little hard to do because your hand always wants to go like, whoa, 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 whoa. But, you know, you just got to keep working on it. Make it pretty straight. After I get the, the good sketch down, I'm going to take going with a pen and I'm going to, I'm going to, um, make it all, I'll make the lines all black and go on. Looking a little messy right now, but you know, they always do look a little messy. Okay, he's got another wheel just pinking out over here. It's like a spy is pinking out. Wheels are always kind of hard for me to do, especially wheels like this that aren't just round. They're just like in kind of in perspective, I guess, because you can, you can like see the top and then the side and nothing else. Kind of, kind of always hard for me to do. Bronco, yeah, he's pretty cool. He's a flipper bot, which means he takes his flipper here and he flips out a bot way up in the air, and it's pretty fun to watch. Yeah. 
and the guy that built him, um, I think their name is Alexander Wolf and Reason Brady. They are really nice. Like they just seem like so nice. It's nice to watch people who are just really, really nice. Yep, they're fun to watch on BattleBots. Wait, I'm trying to get his back here. And he has this interesting little plate of armor on his back. Mm, let's see. I think it's like this. And then like, like this. Mm, maybe like this. Yeah, battle bots are kind of hard to draw because they're so intricate. And they got so many parts to them. Oh, kind of messed up that on there. But that's okay because we can always go in with an eraser. Yeah, he's kind of got, on his wheel, this wheel back here, he's got some armor. Because, you know, in Battle Boss, if they rip your wheels off, man, you, you are sitting duck and you get counted out and it's a knockout. Yeah, Battle Boss is really fun to watch. I'm really excited to be starting this new channel. Because, you know, I, I, I really like drawing these Battle Bots. So, yeah. Yep, I think I'm gonna have to clean this up a little bit going with, with my Oweta. But you know what? It's important to get started. I just wanted to dive right in. Because like I said, it can be a little scary. So I just wanted to dive right in. But I think I'll have to probably go in with my Oweta and clean up this rip a little bit. I got these really good Oweta's on a deal on Amazon. They're like, um, high polymer Oweta's. And you see, I've been using it a lot. I always say, you know, when, you know, when you're learning to draw, you're also learning. How to erase. <laughs> Cause you know, every great artist needs to erase. These are erases are really good. Got a deal on Amazon on them. I got a bunch of them in a little box. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. Gotta get that out of there. Okay, I got it all erased. And now I just need to get the angle of this flipper right. Like I said, since he's just a lot of straight lines, sometimes it's a little hard to get it good. Cause about cause my arm wants to curve. <laughs> it doesn't want to be doing. Maybe um I'll probably use a ruler when I go in for my line art maybe. Wait no, I think it goes like this. I'm always so messy with my nine. <laughs> okay. I will probably might go in with a ruler to get my line art, but right now I'm just use, not going to use a ruler. I kind of like how it's kind of free, like that. Okay, I basically got like a basic rough sketch of Blanco. So now I'm going to kick it into time lapse. The woo, time lapse. And I'm just going to go through and sure up all of these lines. And then I'm going to come back and say a word. And then I'm going to get to started on the line art. And it's going to come alive when that happens. So let me go on the, in the time lapse so I can get this shirt up. Get all this messiness out of here. Woo! Okay, so let's go. All my nine straightened up and I also added the little bunk on the little details on his flipper and of course the sponsors you're gonna put the sponsors on there Bronco sponsors not my sponsors <laughs> and I have no idea how this happened but look how big his flipper and everything is 
It looks like this iron body has been pumping iron. He's like already like strong. Cause look how big it looks right here. Isn't that funny? Oh well. And these wheels. Me and wheels. It's like a... We, it's so funny because I just got to sit and I got to sit and chew at the line to try to get it straight. It's hard for me to draw wheels, but I know I'll get better the more I do it. Now it's time for me to take this Prismacolor Premier pen in the number three size to go in and make it all the lines black and really nice. I'm going to do that in time. I just dropped a bunch of stuff. I'm going to be using this ruler to help me get them... Get the lines a little straighter. You know, you should never feel bad about using a ruler. And oddly enough, this is a McDonald's ruler. I don't know. I've had it for a long time. I found it in my drawer. So I'm like, oh. And I feel that. Isn't it funny? Look at that star. <gasps> star. Bronco's a star. <laughs> funny. Okay. I'm going to kick it into time lapse now and get this all inked up. I got all the line art done. Woo! Woo! Doesn't it look so different now? Whoa! Okay, now it is time to get in and color it. I got a great cut of pencil. So let's just, let's just jump right into it. Okay. Just gonna start. Just gonna start. I'm gonna start scratching away, guys. Scratching away. I'm sorry if this video is kind of long. It's been literally, I think, a year since I made a drawing video, so I'm a little out of practice. Just gotta get some gray in here. Yep. Yeah, so I'm a little out of practice. It's a, I can't believe it's literally been a year. I made some, of course, uh, as you might remember, I made a couple of drawing videos on my main channel, Cath and the Queen Drag. That was pretty fun. And I've always kind of wanted to make a channel for it because I really do love the wine. I think it's so fun. It's a really fun thing to do, you know. I think it's a good skill to have. I'm starting out pretty night. Because I want everything, you know, to, to look good. So I'm starting out pretty nice with the uh, kind of pants on. I can probably push a little bit more. There we go. I know this place is dark. I know from looking at my reference photo that this place is kind of dark. So I can push pretty hard. Yeah. Push pretty hard. Cut it at that a little bit. Man, guys, wheels. Wheels. Wheels are so hard for me to draw. I feel like I've said that several times, but I'm saying it again. So hard. I don't know why. I guess I just find it kind of hard to get it straight. But that's okay. Okay, I'm just going to keep cutting away. I'll, see you, I'll talk to you in a little bit. Okay, I am done with all the, the black and the gray. So now I'm gonna go in with the red. Ooh, ooh, red. I'm sorry I can't show all of the little coloring. This video will be way too long if I did. But now I'm gonna go in and do the red. And then I'm gonna be back to say a few final words. Final words. Okay, boom.
there we have it. Death is my finished picture of Bronco. Woo! Bronco is just so awesome and I'm so happy that I got that drum. This was so much fun to do. I hope you guys had fun watching. Now this channel is, is where I'm really excited about this channel. I'm going to be drawing a lot more battle bots in the future. So stay tuned for that. As you may have guessed from the name, it's Robot Drawing Time. This channel is dedicated to drawing battle bots. So I hope you tune in for more videos in the future. BattleBots is so awesome, I just gotta draw. You can tell me in the comment section down below what you think of this Blanco drawing wall. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a like and subscribe if you did. Okay, goodbye. Bye 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 Blanco. Goodbye Blanco. Bye 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 bye. Goodbye. Boom.